and that is running. All right, I got a head cam on and also the standard camera. Hopefully I can get this right. Uh, what we're doing out here today at beautiful Windmill Harbor is we are just giving you guys a quick walkthrough of a 2004 320 Sundancer. I hope I got the year right. Um, as you guys can see, I'm walking through with my head cam. And what we want to do is just give you guys a, uh, you know, a little bit of extra, uh, some pictures, real simple. I'm not going to get into the technical details of the vessel, uh, but we do know that uh, still pictures do sometimes lie, so we do want to just show you um, how beautiful this particular vessel is. Very well maintained, very well serviced. Uh, we did just check the hours. I know one of the engines was just replaced recently uh, under warranty. Uh, she runs like a top and uh, I haven't been out but uh, the service guys have been and overall uh, we just have a real nice beautiful boat we have a motivated seller and what we want to do is just get this boat sold uh, and that's why we're out here so what we're doing here is we are just giving you a little better look keep in mind uh, this vessel has been sitting out through this weather the last couple of weeks I did not take the time to rinse her up or clean her up but I did want to show you how beautiful she is so what we're going to do real quick is we are going to actually just kind of walk around and just to give you a better look and of the condition of everything that's going on here. And it's a beautiful day out here out at Windmill Harbor. Finally we get a quarter break in the weather. So I am trying my best to get the videos caught up. We are also working with another broker on this particular vessel and this is the assistance that we're offering. Uh, I would say basically the sun pad, you know, has been very well used and is worn. So that might want to be something that you might want to get replaced. But as far as the rest of the vessel goes, uh, it is about as clean and neat as you can get. Hopefully this head cam is getting what I need. Then I just give you guys a quick shot of the windlass all the way through. I did walk through the vessel a few times. Uh, you know, no discernible stress anywhere. Everything is in pretty good shape. I would assume other than your normal a snap here and a little a bit of elbow grease there. Uh, she hails with uh, twin Merc 6.2s and there is no Jenny, uh, but there is uh, air conditioning and water and heat. So we will, uh, or, or, a, or an Atwood is on this anyway. I did just pop up the hatch and what we're gonna do is just kind of pop down. It's funny with all this bad weather, I'm a little out of practice. So let's just give you guys a real good look. I don't even know where my head cam is going. But as you guys can see, just normal wear and tear. We can clean that up, if, you know, with just a little bit of detail. Uh, basic detail will have this vessel uh, looking about as pretty as she can get. Um, showing no uh, tears or rips in any of the cushions, any of the seats. And hopefully you guys are seeing what I'm seeing. Uh, decks in clean and great shape. Uh, not aware of uh, generally these vessels have carpeting. Uh, as you guys can see the snaps, um, I haven't seen it, so uh, I don't know if it's with it or without it, but really that's, you know, minor beans compared to the crux of the matter. So anyway, we're just taking a quick look so you guys can get a secondary, basically a different perspective than just the uh, straight pictures. Not really showing much uh, sun fading. Um, like I said, the vessel's been very well maintained. Seats look like they're in great, great shape. Raymarine uh, E80 is working. Uh, Raymarine VHF, we have Clarion Marine Stereo, uh, everything else is exactly as it should be. There are the controls on the helm, and what we're going to do is we're just going to pop down in here. I'm showing up here on the, uh, where you're going to close the chest to get into the, uh, you know, down, you got a little bit of a chip right there, but overall not that big of a deal as we get into the cabin. Uh, hopefully we're getting plenty of light in here. It's just, it's clean, it's neat, everything is as you would expect on a vessel like this, very well taken care of. Um, you know, I'm just going to kind of bounce around for you guys. I did just update a few pictures, um, you know, outside ca uh, canvas and covers. Uh, the uh, side, the glass seems to be in good shape. No real issues, no red flags, um, you know, she just, this 320 Sundancer is what she is. We have a motivated seller. It's time for this boat to go. And let's just take a quick look down in here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to move some stuff. 
over to the side and pop open so we can see what we got going on here. So you guys get a good look. So you guys can see no gen set. But AC, water heat, air conditioner, microwave, all the amenities that you would need. But that's pretty much it, plain and simple. Let's just take a quick look in the head. Let's go in here. All right, so you guys can see. Overall, just a real clean, beautiful vessel, uh, you know. And if we can, maybe if you guys can hang out with Rob at I'm always in hotwater.com, let's, is what we're gonna do is let's pop up the hatch real quick while we're here. I know a lot of people, you know, hey, let's, let's see what's going on. Patience. Dedicate this visit video to my new uh, uh, baby girl Mika that was just born on December 29th. She's doing quite well and she is beautiful. She's now seven weeks old. So if this video seems to be a little bit off, just kind of keep in mind, daddy's not getting much sleep. All right, let's take a quick look underneath the hatch as we're getting there. And I have already been in here and I have taken some pictures. Let's just take a quick look and see what we got going on so you guys can see. Also, I'm also trying to get this GoPro in sync for when we do our underwater videos, uh, especially for our big vessels. Check out bottom hulls and things along that line. Hopefully this video will do. I had to knock down the resolution a little bit so you guys can see what we got going on. I'll just kind of scan you guys around a little bit nice and easy with my head and let's just take a quick look over here just you know like i said pretty straightforward reasonable offers will be entertained uh as always personal items as seen in the videos and in the pictures are not i'm going to turn my head with this camera are not included and we always recommend uh, get any vessel that you put on the contract surveyed, um, you know, for your peace of mind. Always available, sea trials available under approved contracts. And once we get this down, I'm going to pop on out the boat and give you guys just one last look of bone temp. And we're there. Anyway, Rob out here, and I'm always in hotwater.com. Advertising sales, marketing, and brokerage services. Wishing you guys a great and safe day, and I hope this kind of gives you a little better view uh, and, you know, on a current perspective of uh, the condition of this beautiful 320 Sundancer. Rob out here, and I'm always at hotwater.com, signing off with a beautiful view out of Windmill Harbor. Oops, I'm going to turn off this camera too.